Okay, this is just a short little video to show you what you can do with sound as an input in Scratch. So, what I've got is, you can see there's our friendly cat in Scratch, Scratch Cat. And I've got my sensor board plugged in, so I've got my values here. Oh, one of these keeps moving. I wonder if you can figure out why, when I speak. Sometimes the number goes up, especially if it's loud. Okay, so you can figure out what's going on. The sound sensor, which I have here on my Pico board, there's like a little microphone. And as I make noise, even if I tap on it, look, tap, tap, tap. Or if I blow on it like a breeze, I'll do that now, watch. That drives it crazy. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use some script to, to make the cat do something when I speak or when I make noise. So the first thing I've got is when clicked. So when clicked, something is going to happen. And I wanted to do this forever. So I drag that up onto there. Okay, now, and I don't have a tripod. I need to try and hold this camera steady. There we go. So then the next thing is I'm going to say set Y to zero. So the cat, which is over here, it's on Y zero at the moment. Let me just click, see? Cat's not moved. And you can see that white bit around the outside. That means that script is running at the moment. Now, I'm going to bring something else in. I have got a sensor that says when uh, sound value. So set Y to sound value. Now, before we go and look at the cat, I wonder if you can figure out what the cat's doing. So I'm talking. It says set Y. That's the vertical, vertical position of the cat. Let's scroll over and let's... Oh, look what's happening. Jump, 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 jump high. Up really high. Yes. So if I make a big loud noise, the cat stays in the air. Or if I make a quiet one, it just pops up and down like that. Okay. So it's not just the cat that's crazy. This teacher's a bit crazy as well. Okay, there we go. 